Well, now it's time for Top Topic here on Media Watch, where we take a look at one of the stories making headlines here in China. And today's topic deals with a store inside of a government building that was found to be selling fake Louis Vuitton merchandise. Now, the story goes on to say that two village officials who rented part of a government building to a counterfeiter of Louis Vuitton products in the city of Zhangjiang has been given reprimands. Law enforcement officials said more than 7,000 Louis Vuitton bags and wallets worth more than 25 million renminbi were found in the government building following a raid on July 12th. The City Commission for Disciplinary Inspection of Zhangjiang said local police and local commerce and industry officials were tipped off by residents. The commission said Fu Chao Wen and Zhou Fei Qian, who are party committee officials for the village of Yuanfa, have been given warnings but are not likely to face further punishments as there is no evidence they knew the building's tenant was making fake goods. The commission said a local police officer talked to local party committee into renting the second and third floor of the government building to a leather goods maker for just 10,000 renminbi a year. Village officials helped the counterfeiter to officially register as a leather goods manufacturer, and the rent was noted as government income on the village's accounts, according to the commission's official statement. Gao Xiaoyuan, who is a media officer with the commission, said the police officer is still being investigated by the commission and the police for trademark infringement. Gao went on to say that counterfeit products were being sold in many places, including Guangzhou, adding that Fu and Zhou have already received a demerit in accordance with party regulations. So it looks like they might have to do something a bit harsher in order to make these officials learn their lesson.